how fellow runners honored a jogger kidnapped and killed during her early morning routine, pointing out that running while female shouldn't be a reason to lose your life. ABC's Owen Lopez has more. Female runners across America taking to the streets early Friday morning in solidarity with Eliza Fletcher. Hundreds of women lacing up in her hometown of Memphis, finishing the 10-mile route Fletcher was running before she was abducted and killed last Friday at 4.20 a.m. And similar runs in Eliza's honor kicking off in Nashville, Charlotte, Philadelphia, and Kansas City. This is Cleotha Henderson waits behind bars to face first-degree murder charges in her death. Henderson, who is being held without bail, was in court Thursday as a judge ruled on motions in his case. Fletcher's murder, the latest in recent years to draw attention to the dangers women face while running. In 2018, University of Iowa student Molly Tibbetts was murdered after being targeted during a run. And just a few months later, 35-year-old Wendy Karina Martinez was stabbed on her run in a trendy Washington, D.C. neighborhood. Now, in the wake of Fletcher's murder, women taking to Twitter to share the frustration they have about the dangers they face while exercising outdoors, using the hashtag Eliza Fletcher. The dialogue should not be, why was she running at 4 o'clock in the morning? It should be, why did she get killed when she was running at 4 o'clock in the morning? Runner Laura Green posting this video detailing the constant thoughts some women have while running. Is he following me or are those my own footsteps? I mean, we're told to do the same things every time, right? We bring mace, we have a whistle, we tell our partner where we're going or a friend. We have beacons on our phones. We have our cell phones with us. We don't run with headphones. But I think that what's being taught to us is that it doesn't matter what time of day you run. It doesn't matter what clothing you wear. We are still targets. And that's incredibly terrifying. And guys, the organizers of this event say they created the run to honor her and to emphasize that women should be able to run safely at any time of the day. And Janae, that is exactly what they did this morning. Uh, because, Elwin, as that woman put it, the idea that women have to be terrified when they're going running is terrifying itself. Elwin, thank you so much. Well, hey there, GMA fans. Robin Roberts here. Thanks for checking out our YouTube channel. Lots of great stuff here. So go on, click the subscribe button right over, right over here to get more of awesome videos and content from GMA every day, anytime. We thank you for watching, and we'll see you in the morning on GMA.